10 Famous People Who Were Widowed Young List of Celebrities Who Were Widowed Young, Loosely Ranked By Fame And Popularity Several famous people have suffered the devastating blow of losing a spouse when they were young. Some celebrities lost their spouses to suicide, while others lost their significant others to cancer. Famous actors, musicians, authors, and politicians have all been widowed young. Who is the most famous person who was widowed young? Courtney Love tops our list. The whole frontwoman became a widow at age 30, after her husband Kurt Cobain committed suicide in 1994. Cobain struggled with heroin addiction, illness and depression for most of his life and his death solidified him as a member of the Forever 27 Club. Conspiracy theorists believe that love may have played a role in Cobain's death. Pierce Brosnan became a widower at 38 when his wife Cassandra Harris died from ovarian cancer in 1991. Brosnan described the difficult time when his wife was dying of cancer saying, when your partner gets cancer, then life changes. Your timetable and reference for your normal routines and the way you view life, all this changes. Because you're dealing with death. You're dealing with the possibility of death and dying. Do you think these celebrities will ever get over the death of their spouses? Share your thoughts in the comments section. Patton Oswalt. Patton Oswalt was just 45 when his wife passed away in her sleep in April 2016, leaving behind their seven-year-old daughter. Michelle McNamara was a crime writer and founder of a website called TrueCrimeDiary.com. No cause of death was immediately revealed, but family and friends reported being shocked by her passing. McNamara was 46 years old, Joe Biden. Joe Biden became a widower at age 30. His wife of six years, Nelia Hunter, died in a car accident in 1972, along with the couple's one-year-old daughter, Naomi. Their two sons, Bo and Hunter, survived the accident. Biden married his second wife, Jill Jacobs, in 1975. They have one daughter, Oscar Wilde. Oscar Wilde became a widower at age 44. His wife of 14 years, Constance Lloyd, died after injuries associated with a fall down the stairs in 1898. At the time, the couple was estranged, and Wilde was in prison. After her death, Constance's relatives sought legal counsel to keep Wilde away from their sons, Cyril and Vivian. Terry Irwin. Terry Irwin became a widow at age 42. Her husband, crocodile hunter Steve Irwin, was killed by a stingray in 2006 at age 44. The couple had two children, Bindi and Robert. Henry Fonda. Henry Fonda became a widower at age 45. His second wife, Frances Ford Seymour, committed suicide in 1950. After 13 years of marriage, Fonda had asked her for a divorce, and she entered a psychiatric hospital. On her 42nd birthday, she slit her own throat. She had a daughter from a previous marriage, and her children with Henry were Peter and Jane Fonda. He married three more times, Courtney Love. Courtney Love became a widow at age 30. Her second husband, Kurt Cobain, committed suicide in 1994, two years after they married. Love has not remarried since. Pierce Brosnan. Pierce Brosnan became a widower at age 38. His wife of 17 years, Cassandra Harris, died from ovarian cancer in 1991. Brosnan and Harris had one son together, and he adopted her two children from a previous marriage, Charlotte and Christopher, after their father died in 1986. Tragically, Charlotte Harris also died of ovarian cancer in 2013, when she was 41. Brosnan married Keely Shea Smith in 2001, and the couple has two sons together, Elizabeth Taylor. Elizabeth Taylor became a widow at age 26. Her third husband, Mike Todd, died in a plane crash a year after they married. Of Taylor's eight marriages, it was her only one that did not end in divorce. Roman Polanski. Roman Polanski became a widower at age 36 when his second wife, actress Sharon Tate, was murdered in 1969. She and four others were stabbed to death in the home she shared with Polanski by the notorious Manson family. They had been married for less than two years, and Tate, 26, was eight months pregnant at the time of her murder. Polanski has been married to Emmanuel Sagner since 1989. The couple has two children. Jacqueline Kennedy Onassis. Jackie Kennedy became a widow at age 34. Her husband of 10 years, President John F. Kennedy, was assassinated in November 1963 at age 46. The murder followed the death of their son, Patrick, who died in August 1963 at just two days old. The couple had two other children, Caroline and John Jr. Jackie married Aristotle Onassis in 1968, but was widowed for the second time in 1975, Anna Nicole Smith. Anna Nicole Smith became a widow age 28. 
Her second husband, 90-year-old millionaire J. Howard Marshall, died of natural causes and old age in 1995. Smith informally married Howard K. Stern in a commitment ceremony in 2006, but tragically died of a drug overdose in 2007. Check out our new videos on our channel, where new celebrity news is coming soon. And subscribe to our YouTube channel, and ring that bell, so you don't miss a single thing.